WGEM Sports with Sports Director Tony Cornish Jr. The 30 and 1 Raiders from Quincy, Notre Dame didn't have a real extensive scouting report on the 20 and 15 Cardinals of Pleasant Plains heading into their class to a regional semifinal showdown today on the QND campus. Didn't need one. Blue and gold starter Tyler Dance had a simple plan of action on the hill. Throw strikes and let his teammates do what they've done all season long. Back him up with some solid D when and if needed against the cars. The action we go as I expected. There was no empty seats for this highly anticipated matchup. Tie game 1 1 bottom of the second. Q&D will look to take the lead here as Colin Kirk swings and sends a fastball in the center. Some confusion from the Pleasant Plains defense will buy enough time to bring home Jack Lindenfelser and give Q&D a 2 to 1 lead. Keeping the fires hot. That's Raiders Jake Sizzler hitting a ground ball past second base to bring home freshman Gavin Dolman and that RBI double add to Q&D's lead. Tucker Tolerton. We'll get in on the action. He hits a fastball here deep in the center, which brings home yet another run. It's a 5-1 lead for Q&D. You get the picture here. When it's all said and done and the smoke clears, Raiders will get a 9-1 victory over Pleasant Plains, and they will advance the regional championship game. They love playing at the third. It's amazing knowing that you have a really good nice field where you're going to get good hops, and you're just used to it. You're a lot more comfortable instead of going somewhere else where you're not as comfortable. But I think offensively and defensively and with our pitching staff, we're all pretty confident with our abilities right now.